Lung cancer, it's a big deal. Smoking causes lung cancer. Smoking is usually a choice. Asbestos isn't. Asbestos was widely used in construction due to its versatility until it was banned in the EU in 2005. When damaged or in state of disrepair, asbestos fibers are released into the air, posing a lethal threat, including lung cancer. Every year, between 30,000 and 90,000 people die of exposure to asbestos. Yet, asbestos-related diseases are usually not recognized as occupational diseases. Victims and their families have been left abandoned. Asbestos was a ban uh, in Europe uh, in 2005. There was a total ban, but we have a situation where 80% of the buildings in Europe were built before the total ban uh, took place. The millions of tons of asbestos currently in buildings across Europe represent a health risk under the European Green Deal renovation wave aimed at helping make buildings fit for a climate-neutral Europe. And that means when we are in a situation where buildings are being renovated but uh, can lead to a lot of exposure uh, for workers working uh, on asbestos, construction workers, but also firefighters and people using buildings, living in buildings, being neighbors to buildings that are, are renovated. We know that alone in 2019, more than 90,000 people died of asbestos-related diseases. And this is a number that is growing. And therefore, if we do not take action now, we will risk that tens of thousands, not least of construction workers, will lose their life in, in the green uh, renovation if, if we do not make sure that there's better protection against asbestos. Basically, we're putting forward a proposal for a strategy for the removal of all asbestos in Europe, because that is needed. If we want to have a socially just transition, we need to make sure that those who do the job, who renovate the houses, do not lose their lives. So that means that we need to adapt the limit value to the newest uh, science, saying that even low exposure to asbestos can be deadly, and we need to have mandatory screenings of houses before renovation. We need to have public registers so we know where the asbestos is in the houses and not least we need to have better and mandatory uh, and very good education of the workers who are uh, going out and doing the, the renovation. So this is the proposal coming from the, from the Parliament and I really hope the Commission will listen.